multiplication involving binomials and trinomials in two variables, we're asked to multiply these two expressions. The first one is a trinomial, it's got three terms, and the second one's got two terms. But to do that, we just need to take it apart and do it one piece at a time. So starting with the 5x in the first term, I can distribute that 5x to each of the terms in the second expression. So we would have 5x times x, that would give us a 5x squared, and then 5x times the 6w, that would give us 5 times 6 is 30, and the x times the w would just be xw. So we've distributed the 5x, now I want to distribute the next term, which is the 4w. So distributing the 4w, and that's a negative 4w, negative 4w times x would be negative 4xw. And of course that leading coefficient there is 1, so the negative 4 times the 1 gave me the negative 4. And then also I need to multiply the second term, negative 4 times the 6w. Negative 4 times 6 is negative 24. W times W would give us W squared. And then we still have the 7 in the first term. And that also needs to be distributed. So if I distribute that 7, 7 times the 1x is 7x. And 7 times the 6w, 7 times 6 is 42. They're both positive. And there's still the w there. So 7 times 6w is 42w. We've done the multiplication, but we definitely need to simplify things. So I'm looking for some like terms that I can combine together. Uh, the first term that I see here, the 5x squared, that's the only x squared that I have. So I'm going to leave it alone, just bring it down. But when I look at the xw's, I see that these two terms are the same, or they're like terms, so I can combine those together as well. 30xw minus 4xw would give me a 26xw. The next term is a w squared, and I only have one of those, so I'm just going to leave it, minus 24w squared. Uh, only one x term, the 7x, and only one 